Hey guys, so today we're going to be reviewing this Givenchy Vox box that I received. And if you guys don't know, Influencer is a website and an app where you just do surveys on what you like and according to what you like and the reviews that you post, they send you free makeup and they send you luxury items like the Givenchy, which that's crazy. Like I've never received something so luxurious. I have received Smashbox, Makeup Forever, so those are pretty high-end products. But this is probably the most high-end product that I've ever received from them. So you guys should definitely check them out because you just get free makeups. And all you have to do is just review the product. And that's just basically how you feel about the product, um, what you like, what you don't like. And then you get points and the more reviews that you do, the more chances you have of getting more makeup as long as you do your surveys and your reviews. So they sent me their new Le Rouge liquid. So it's a liquid lipstick and it's a pretty cool packaging which I will show you. And I'm, I got the color Nude Tafetas 106 um, which is up my alley. It's a nice pink nude so I love the color. Um, they must know me really well because that is all the color that I gravitate towards. So, um, let me just read you what it says. It says, it's hyaluronic acid formula hydrates and smooths like a nourishing lip balm, while clay extracts create a brilliant sheath effect that wraps your pout in an intense color without a hint of drying. Basically, this liquid lipstick is supposed to be like a nourishing liquid lipstick, which is kind of different because most liquid lipsticks are drying because they're usually matte. Liquid lipsticks are supposed to last all day, so usually formulas are very drying just to keep it lasting all day. But this one is a velvet finish. It blurs and hydrates. So I'm going to go over the price of this. So this retails for $37. $37 for a lipstick. I would never pay that. So it comes in this cool packaging. Um, you take it off. And then the part that I love about this is when you when you twist it up, the product actually comes out from the top. So it's not like a traditional applicator. Um, it's pretty cool actually. So you just twist it up until you get product and then you apply it to your lips. So I'm going to go ahead and apply it to my lips and tell you how it feels. <laughs> tell you that it feels like a mix between a lip gloss, a lipstick, and a liquid lip because it's that moisturizing. It feels like, it doesn't have the sticky feeling of a lip gloss, but it feels like moisturizing, like a lip balm and lip gloss. And it's pretty shiny, so I like how it looks. This color matches everything right here. So I'm really a fan of this color. Um, I don't know how long this would last because hasn't dried down yet. I don't know if it does dry down, so we'll give it a few minutes and then we'll see if it does dry down. So far, I like the formula. It's very moisturizing, so I would love to wear this on a day out and not feel like my lips are so chapped. And so we'll be back in a few minutes to tell you if it dries down or if it transfers in it or anything like that. So it's been like five to seven minutes. It still feels moisturizing. It feels drier than when I first put it on but it doesn't feel like it completely dried down, so I'm gonna do the hand pass, which is... And look, it's not transfer proof, but it feels just like a lipstick, so I really like this formula because all I wear are lipsticks on a day-to-day -day basis. I don't wear liquid lips unless I have to be out for like a full day, but I don't wear it to work, I don't wear it to school, I don't wear it anywhere unless it's like an event that I need it to last, like throughout eating throughout everything but not on a regular basis I don't wear liquid lipsticks so I really love this formula because it's like a lipstick and I hope it lasts I'm gonna show you some update pictures at the end to see how long it actually lasted and if it lasts throughout the day um and so far I like it the only downside of this is that it's $37. I personally would not pay $37 for something that feels like a lipstick because I can just wear a lipstick then. Um, aside from that high price, if you do have the money and you like luxe, luxurious lipsticks, go ahead and splurge because the formula is amazing. But I personally 
don't have the heart to buy this for myself, so I'm super glad that Influencer sent me one. Just an update on the lipstick. It obviously did not last. I had about like three meals in between. I ate three times. It wasn't three meals. But um, my lips are feeling super moisturized. It didn't last though, and I feel like a matte liquid lipstick would have lasted at least through two of those times that I ate, and I feel like this was gone after I ate the first meal and it was barely there. So it did leave like a little bit tint, but there's like no product left on my lips and I purposely did not like rub off my lips either. So I know I didn't take it off purposely, but as you can see, it's completely gone. So I definitely would not pay the $37 because I could definitely find a matte or even another liquid lipstick that I could keep on for the whole day. This I know I would have to reapply just because it is moisturizing and it's not matte. So I know it's not going to last all day just because it was super moisturizing like a lip balm. It didn't have that and it also did transfer so I feel like it just wouldn't last a long period of time. But then again they didn't put that on their packaging that it does last a long period of time. But I wouldn't go ahead and pay $37 for that because I can find that in a Luxe lipstick from Colourpop which is just as moisturizing and I feel like it lasts way longer too because after I have a meal and I come home the lipstick will still be stained on my lips but this one I feel like didn't last as long as even that lipstick would so I don't really I wouldn't buy it but it does it's a good formula so if you have the money and you like to buy expensive items go ahead but for me personally I will not repurchase that and if you guys like these kind of short reviews, make sure to like this video and subscribe. And thank you guys so much for watching.